Alrighty, everyone. Welcome back to Pal World. Here we go, booting up. I cannot wait to see the incorrect avatar on boot. So I haven't played this in a week, and I have no idea what they've updated. Every week when I play this, it says a bunch of, like, patches have applied, but I never actually know... Oh, here we go, T-posing. I never actually know what it actually is that, uh, that they've updated. So I wonder what they updated in the last week here on the Xbox. Apparently the Xbox is still, no exaggeration, about 20 updates behind PC. Do you think you can name a pal yet? I don't think so. Do you see a way to name a pal? I don't see a way to name a pal. Did they used to make the noise when you scrolled over them like this? I don't think they did, did they? So maybe that's something new. I don't recall them making the sound effect. Hmm. Well, I don't see a way to name them yet. Uh, so what are we working towards? We're working towards a wheat plantation and a cooking pot, right? And if you take a look at the wheat plantation or cooking pot, I think... So the wheat plantation, we need one wheat seed. So we have to head out and try to find a wheat seed out in the wild, and then we could make that. The cooking pot is way down here at level 17. So no. Um, how many uh, balls do I have? I have 11. If I could craft more of the balls, that would certainly be helpful. Um, what is this? A skill fruit spirit fire. How do I have to get this? I don't want to use that. Do I have a box I could put that in? Yes. Let's put that in. Okay. So I have food. I'm good there. Right? I'm good on food. So what we need to do is find wheat and level up more, which means i got to catch more pals, right? They sell wheat seeds at a small settlement. I've never found a small settlement. I don't even know what you're talking about. We haven't found it yet. Look, this is the only places I've explored. I've only played for seven hours, so I guess I have to keep exploring. I don't even know where the small settlement is. Would it be down? Would it be this way? Would it be, to the? I guess, maybe left of the boss? I don't know, because we didn't kill the boss yet. Yeah. Anyway... Alright, um, what were we doing? Oh, I wanted to see if I can get more balls, or craft more balls, before we left. No, it says we need paldium fragments. Don't we have paldium fragments being worked over here? I feel like we did. Ah! Can we make more? Yes! Let's make 50 paldium fragments. That's gonna take a while to make, but at least we'll be able to have those. Says I'm hungry, so let's pop a, a lamb ball kebab. Perfect. Wow, that filled us up nicely. All right. Okay, good. So we'll have him working on the, those fragments at some point. I don't know why he ran away. <laughs> he was supposed to do it, and then he hopped away because he's hungry. Okay, Um. so you can name your pals in the menu. No, I don't think you can. I don't think you can. Uh, I'll show you. Look, here's the menu. Party. Do you see anywhere where it says you can name your pals? If I go here, pal box management, move view details. Let's say I wanted to view details on this one, X. As you can see, no. Xbox still does not have the ability to name the, the pals. It's still not in here. After three weeks of this game being out, they didn't add it yet. That's pretty bad that they're running that far behind, but what can you do? All right, uh, I think we're ready to head out then. Uh, Haseo says, if you try if you take, try to take on the boss, will you try to catch it? Unless it's legit to catch it, no. I'm only going to try to catch it if you could do it, like, normal. I don't want to abuse the game and find some exploit to catch the boss. That's ridiculous. I know some people have found that, but I don't... Well, I'm just going to do it normally, you know? So I open the, open the menu, view details, it should say edit. I'm telling you, I'm telling you it's not there. Look, here's the... Here's the... There. There's nowhere. I'm telling you it's not on here. It, it seems to only be on PC. There's no option to do it here on console. Yeah. They never added it to console. So the console is that far behind. <clears throat> okay. What's up, No Sleep Real Vibes? Good evening. He's going to get a pepperoni pizza sub when he goes to P Firehouse Subs, he says. So here we are. Boy, this is the worst map I've ever seen. Um... Can we get past the tower? I can hover now. So I'm wondering if I can go past, like, hover down here. I probably could. 
Oh, there's a lot of water, though. Oh, shoot. Because I want to go over there. Because that's an area I haven't been to yet. Can I run around the tower to get over there? And what about my... Uh, here, is, here he is. Let's ride him. Come over here, Melpaka. Where are you running for? Get back over here. There we go. This is much be much be much faster doing it this way. Okay. <clears throat> yeah, they're that far behind on console, like significantly far behind. All right, we can go this way. If we jump across, man, this is we still gotta climb though. What a pain. Maybe if we go all the way over to that ledge and jump down. Like, is there a way to do this or not? Because I'm gonna run out of stamina before I ever climb the wall, aren't I? Can you do a running jump? Let's try that. No, you can't. If you're running, you can't jump. Oh, shit. Well, that didn't work very well. <laughs> At least he could swim, but he does have stamina, so this could be a problem. I never tried this before. Oh, I do have some flying pals, but we don't have the ability to put the uh, the saddle or whatever it is on the flying one yet. So we haven't done that yet. Or we did, but we didn't have the ingredients to do it. Like, I know we couldn't do it when we were looking at it. Great, so we're just swimming now. I think we can get over here, though. Looks like there is some ground ahead, and we are getting our stamina back, so I guess we could just go right up here. Alright, let's head up here. To this ground area. We haven't been over here yet. Maybe we'll find some new pals or something. Remember, we're looking for wheat and catching more pals that we don't have yet. So that way we can level up. We have to hit level 17 to do the next thing for uh, the guide or tutorial. It says uh, cooking pot. And that's level 17. And right now we're level 15. Uh, I don't see anything right now, right? Like, nothing really. But this is a new environment. Here's a new guy. Now, who is that? How do I see? It's a level six, uh, what does it say? A spark it? Level six spark it. Okay. Can I shoot this thing? Yeah, I hit it right in the ass. Catch that spark it, please. We got an egg right here. We caught it. Can I pick up the egg? Yes. And we got a new one. Spark it. New pal captured. Cool. find an egg i'll just pick it up and then we'll go incubate it when we go back to base it would be great to find uh to find some more like another fast travel or something out here vixie do we have a vixie how can you tell if you have one or not does anyone know if you can tell if you caught one yet or not like these have red energy bars but is that all the wild ones have red energy bars or can you tell the difference if you have it or not Slayer, I did get your email. I have not had a chance to read it yet, but I did read it. Or I did uh, receive it. Thank you. I'll give it a look when I get a chance. And I appreciate that. A little follow-up to the React video I did. I don't think we have a Vixie yet. Throw Pal Spear. Summon Pal. Oh, I didn't want to do that. That was a mistake. Oh, I found a ball. Cool. I wanted to figure out, how do I stab when I'm on this thing? Uh, how do I, ah, how do I stab when I'm on this thing? It's not right bumper. I guess I, can I not use the spear? Oh, you gotta aim. You have to aim. Okay. Can we just catch it this way? No, I missed. Oh, shit. I missed. Okay, I didn't miss that time. I smoke crack, a 30-month a member. Thank you so much, I smoke crack. How you doing? Good evening. What a great name. Mark says they have announced... Nintendo has announced they sold 139 million Switch consoles. He says, the, the Switch is the only Nintendo console I have more digital than physical games. Nintendo's new handheld gaming is great. There you go. what I get? I got something. I don't know where to find wheat. We found it randomly before by just exploring. So we'll probably just keep exploring, looking around for wheat. And someone said it's at a human settlement. I haven't found a human settlement. So uh, <clears throat> that's not going to work yet. 
There's eggs all over the place. I wonder what those eggs are for. Ooh! Keep making your way right on the map. The levels get lower. Right on the map? We've already been over there. What noise was that? Did you guys hear that? Something was going crazy over here. Another egg. We're finding tons of eggs. Are these taking up multiple inventory spots? No, they're not. Good. Slayer says he's trying the Dondoko Island of, uh, of Like a Dragon Infinite Wealth while he watches uh, me play. That's cool. I can't wait to do it myself. Hopefully next week. I'll get to it. We shall see. Cecilio says maybe use the time, explore the map more, and open more open the settlements. Exactly. I mean that makes sense. Let's let's see what's out here on the map. Let's grab items we haven't had before. Like we didn't have any mushrooms. Now we have mushrooms. Let's harvest what we can harvest and find what we can find. Level up a bit. If I run into wheat, great. If not, this is still not a wasted trip because we are exploring. I'm definitely liking the fact that I can ride the pals now. Up here we got some ore. What do we got down there? Mm, it looks like... Can I jump across? Because it looks like a different area. Now, that's where we came from, actually. So I probably don't even want to go that way. Now, is that the boss tower? No, that's a different tower. Maybe that's the second boss. Oh, what the shit? Where'd you come from? Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, man, I fell. I ran by accident. Where did he go? Take that, thug. Hammer the nuts. The syndicate thug. My pal is hungry. I'll have to feed him in a second. I spit and I missed. Come on. Come on. Get up there. You want to get up there. You know you want... You know you want to get up there. There we go. That guy's waiting for you to kill him. Take it! I missed. I hit the rock. Poke him. Poke him. Poke him. <laughs> You gotta love that sound effect when they die. Okay. Anyway, you guys are right. These enemies are pretty weak, huh? I'm stuck here. There we go. What happens if I climb this way? Oh, the pal is hungry. Let's feed the pal. Uh, give us some berries. Here, I'll feed an egg. A delicious egg. There we go. Fried eggs. Yummy. And I just picked up more eggs so we'll be able to make more food. Do 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 do. Jump over this. Yeah, that must be the second boss. But it is across a, a river or ravine there. So I don't know if I'd be able to get over there right now if I wanted to. See, a bummer because it's probably a fast travel over there. Whoa, that's a great graphical glitch. What's that? I have no idea. See that? See it's glowing right there? I wonder what that is out in the distance. I have no clue. But the camera's going crazy. Greasy says a very high level boss. What, the second boss is high level? First boss is 18. Right now we're 15. I'm debating today, by the end of today's stream, trying to fight it again. I feel like we have much better equipment and stuff to handle it. So maybe it's worth the, the shot. Whoa, it's like a broken like a broken down cathedral or something down there. Check that out. All right, maybe we will. Let's go down there and see that. And then if we head eastward, it looks like there's one of those items that apparently... Someone had said if you get those green items, that's how you level up your ability to control the pals and stuff. And I did... I was able to upgrade that last time, so... Ooh, three pal spheres and small pal soul. Cool. Do we have these yet? What are these? Pwack? What the hell's a pwack? Thwack? No, it's a thwack. We got it. No, we didn't. Take this, Fwack. Come on. Catch the damn Fwack. We got it. We got the Fwack. What's up, Jade? Good to have you here. He says, I'm just going to talk to Chad. He's not really paying attention to the game. That's all good. It's good to have you here tonight. Man, it's getting dark, huh? Leveled up. We just hit 16. Beautiful. That's what it's all about. We got to hit 17 in order to build the uh, the pot that we're looking for. The cooking pot. And more mushrooms. We're in the desolate gulch. Oh, desolate church. Excuse me. Mushroom. 
Oh, a Paldium Fragment. Oh, you know what? I shouldn't have picked that up. Because... Oh, no, I guess I should have. Um, Enhanced Stats. What do I want to enhance? Health, Stamina, Attack, Carry Weight. Carry Weight. Always Carry Weight, right? Always Carry Weight. Alright. What's in this desolate church? Whoa, why is it glowing? What the hell? Is that save point? Oh, okay. I thought it was a, something crazy. Not a save point. Or yeah, a fast travel point. Castaway's journal. I'm never going to read those, by the way. We did it. Unlock I'm trying it. Here we go. Yeah. And I acquired a tech point. Very nice. So now we can fast travel out here. That's very cool. Ball. We got a pal sphere. Ah, we have one of the things in here. Oh, we have a chest. We have all kinds of stuff in here. Look. It's dark as hell. Can I, uh... There we go. Open. Three bread, low-grade medical supplies, and some coins. And back here, we have one of these upgrade items. Cool. What does this say? Oh, you can enhance stats or pals here. You can actually do it here. So, I need seven. I have one. Ugh. I need six more, and then I can enhance my capture power even higher. All right. Well, there's another one over here we saw. Look, I see one straight ahead way out there. See that? It's like way out there straight ahead. But this way, I saw one over here to the right. More sparkets we can take out. Oh, it was up here at the top of this cliff, so we can find a way to climb this thing. Uh, we should be able to get another one. Let's go this way. It's very hard to see where you're going, but at the same time, it's easier to see other items. Like things stand out at night, right? Nice. Just stand there and take it. Don't move or anything. Just stand there and take it right on the chin. Be a trooper. Give me the experience points. Thanks. <laughs> wow. Okay, then. I got electric organs. We got to climb this thing. Oh, I see the wood I definitely didn't want. That's going to take up an inventory space I don't want. So up here, there was another one. Oh, who do we got here? Depresso? The name of the of the pal is Depresso. What the heck? <gasps> we got it. We caught the Depresso. <laughs> what the heck kind of name is that? Depresso. <sighs> anyway, oh. One of them's asleep. Oh, it's just more spark. It's, there's the green thing I saw, I think. So let's take this guy out. Wow, I killed it in its sleep. Oh, that's brutal. I killed it in its sleep. It didn't even have a chance to defend itself. Wow. That's messed up, man. It's not working. What the hell? It wasn't working. That was really weird. Okay. Dead in his sleep. Jeez. You're like Hitman. <laughs> Taking them out when they're nice and vulnerable. It's a literal night owl. Get it? Nice. More catching. So the good news is we're getting experience. We are leveling, which is one of our goals. The bad news is we haven't found any wheat. All right, so down there, that should be another fast travel point. I believe they all look orange, so I think that's a fast travel point if we can get to it. But in the meantime, I have to eat some more food. Let's eat a grilled chickpea. Yummy. And I might as well give one to my Melpaka, too, before it gets hungry, right? I'll see you tomorrow, Kagome.
Am I still enjoying the game? Yes, I am. SF6 Blanca. Why wouldn't I be? Like I said, this is nice, chill, relaxing fun to me. I'm having a good time. I think we should head down to that other fast travel point if we can. Whoa, there's a unique pal down there. I wonder what level it is. Do you see it? It's like purple. Look at that thing. What is that? Is that... It's level 11. Ooh, this could be a rough one. A Tombat? By the way, how do I swap between my balls? Does anyone remember how to swap between the balls? Oh, there you go. Because I might want to try that. If I try to catch the Tombat, I'll probably want to use the better ball. There's a lot of pals down here, though. And I am nervous that they're all going to aggro to me if I try to take the, take the Tombat out. Hmm. So maybe I should take out some of the weaker ones first. I'm stuck. You serious? I'm stuck? I can't jump up here? The windswept hills. What is going on here? I could easily walk up this in real life. <laughs> I saw a chest down here. Yeah, look, it's down there. Okay, let's go down, grab the chest. Let's take some of these weaker ones out. Ooh, I don't have this yet. I don't have a, di a dire howl. Oh, man, there's so many. Look how many different ones there are here. Okay, well, let's not aggro them yet. Let's go get this chest. Let's try to be strategic about this. There's a lot of pals here. Arrows, gold coins, small pal soul. Those are more who crates. Yeah, there's a ton. I'm not liking that they're all in such a close radius. Or I should say proximity. Not radius, proximity. Because that makes me nervous. That if I try to get the big one, they're all going to aggro to me and it's going to be a pain in the ass. These two I could probably easily take out. Level 5 and 7. Oh, man, I'll take out the 5 first. No, why'd you attack the other one? That's another thing. The game auto-aims. And that can be frustrating because you're trying to aim for one and it aims for another that's sitting right next to it. Okay. There's another one of those green things to grab. So here's the good, the big one. Level 11 combat. We don't have this thing yet. Are we good to fight it now? I think we kind of weeded out the stragglers. Here's something. A jolt hog. It basically looks like a cute little hedgehog. Let's see if we can catch it. No! <gasps> what? That didn't count? Oh, it electrocuted me! <gasps> well, I got it, but now I'm, I'm out of... I'm gonna be out of balls. A TNZ? Do we have a TNZ? I don't think so. There's so many new pals to catch here. Oh, did this one aggro? It did? Oh, no. It says only 30% chance, but we weakened it a ton. Oh, man. Come on, catch it. It's so weak. Come on, yes. No! That's my last ball, unless I use the better one, which I don't really want to do. I got it. Nice. Very nice. Damn. I don't have enough balls to catch other other guys. I want the TNZs, but I just don't have any more balls to capture it in. That stinks. Where's that fast travel point that I could see? Here it is. Let's do the fast travel point so we can come back here. Because there's a lot of new pals here that I'd like to catch. Here we go. Hello, Jolt Hog. How you doing? There's a nice bridge here, too. Look at that. It goes across to a new, a new area. So that's kind of neat. Sweet. All right. Maybe we should... uh. Head back and craft more balls and then come back here. Because we need balls to catch these guys at this point. Let's do that. So let's fast travel. Back to base and craft more balls. Alright, in the meantime... Excuse me, I did get a tip. I'm going to shout that out now. Uh, no, I'm not going to play the Final Fantasy VII Rebirth demo. I'm buying the game for sure at the end of the month. There's no reason for you to play the demo it's so close to it. Um... 
I got a four dollar tip. Someone says, "Question: If you run into a woodchuck in Pal World and to befriend it, you have to answer how much wood could a woodchuck chuck if a woodchuck could chuck wood? If a wood could chuck, if a woodchuck could chuck wood, then a woodchuck would chuck as much wood as a woodchuck could chuck in the time that it takes to chuck." Thank you for the four dollar tip. I used to be able to answer that better. Okay. Thank you for the tip. Uh, how was Baldur Baldur's Gate 3 today? It was good, Jade. We explored a lot of new areas, which was fun. Um, and I'm looking forward to more tomorrow because now we hit this town that's the major p town in uh, the second act. And I was waiting to arrive there, and we have arrived there now. So now we can actually start doing questing and stuff there. So that's tomorrow. Pals for your time. Let's maximize how many we can make. 46? That sounds like a plan to me. Let's do it. Start that production. Let's make those pal spheres, everybody. And we'll unload some of this inventory. I'll probably cook the eggs to make some more food. Jeternal says, do you think you'll ever have time to just enjoy life with Cat? It seems like you're always working. In reality, how many people really just have a lot of time to do whatever they want when they're an adult? I don't think many do, right? Anyone who has kids, forget it. Like, your life is lived for your children, right? For us, at the very least, I get to spend some time with my wife every day before I go to sleep. We get to have meals together. That's something nice because a lot of families don't get to do that because of their work schedules, right? So I'm very happy for the time that we have. And then having the day off a week where we spend time together. Like, last week was really cool. I watched her play Don, uh, Don Doko Island, and then we played Tekken 8 together. That was so fun. I really had a lot of fun last week, so... If anything, the, the one thing we don't have time for is to really go out and do a lot together outside of the house. I wish we did. I wish we could go out and go go to the movies, go shopping, go go out to dinner all the time. We just can't. We, you know, we just don't have the time or means to really do that that often. Usually, on the days we're doing that, it's because we have a million appointments we've lined up for the day out. So half the day is us doing busy work shit that we don't want to do anyway, but we have to, you know. But that's life, man. That is life, and, uh, you know, I still enjoy it. I'm, like I told you, I'm way happier now than I ever was before in my life. I mean that, too. Like, when I was single, <clears throat> I was not happy at all. I was depressed all the time. I wish that I was doing something more meaningful than just, you know, flubbing it at a job or playing fucking games on the internet. And uh, having a, a meaningful home life is definitely something very important to me. So we've leveled up to 16, right? We haven't hit 17 yet. When we hit 17, that's when I can get the cooking pot. Then I need ingots and flame organs, so I'm going to have to kill some fire-type pals. As for ingots, those you craft over here, I believe. Oh, we have them. We have the ingots. We're good on ingots. We just need flame organs. This is a food egg. Yeah, this is not a pal egg. That's a food egg. We should actually do some cooking and then unload some inventory. What the... Select recipe. Let's do some... Oh, we can do mushrooms now. Let's do some baked mushrooms. Let's make them all. Here we go. Bake some mushrooms so we'll have some food. Yes, help me with this. What are you doing? Keep cooking. Where'd you go? <laughs> Stop helping me. Yeah, I know, Sarah. Sarah says you really need to have a vacation with Kat one day. Yeah, I know. It would be nice. It would be nice, but... I mean, there's so many factors against it. Number one, the fact that I can't take that much work off. Number two, who's going to take care of Jasper? Because then you got to arrange and pay for that, and that's expensive. You know, there's all these factors involved, so. Yes, I totally agree. Kat is an amazing woman, Mark. He says, it's awesome to see her on stream. She loves video games, which is awesome. I, yeah, I can't wait to do Dondoko Island co-op with her, and you're going to see her passion for games, you know, together, live. It's really awesome. Knocked says, I had Detroit-style pizza for the first time tonight. What did you think? I have never had Detroit-style pizza. I know what it is. That's the one where they put the ingredients, like, on top of the cheese. So it's, like, dough, cheese, and sauce on top of the cheese, which makes no sense to me. But... <clears throat> what was that? Whoa, someone's happy. All right, we cooked those. Let's cook some eggs. What's weird is I swear half the time 
ingredients just disappear from my inventory. Like, I swear that I had, like, four or five raw eggs, and I went in my inventory and said I only had two. I'm like, where did the rest go? I thought I had more, but whatever. Baked berries. Those we don't need to make right now. Um, alright, I want to unload inventory, and then we're going to go back and, and get to pal catching. If you didn't see, I have, like, 50 balls now. So I definitely can do it, but... I need to unload some inventory here. Um, wood. I didn't mean to pick up wood. Did I pick up wood? I guess I didn't, because I don't see it. So maybe I didn't have wood. I thought it said that I picked up wood. Uh, we can get rid of this. Fibers. Um, ba -ba -da -ba -da -ba -da. Okay, nothing in that one. I, don't, I hate that it doesn't auto-sort this for you. This is pretty annoying. I really wish it put all this stuff together by itself. Rather than having you manually do it. I think that's really bad, actually. Here, bones. Here, I'll put this medicine. Right? This is definitely something they can improve. Have it so that everything auto-combines in inventory. So you're not messing about doing this yourself. This is kind of stupid. Electric organs. Oh, you see, like, the medicine is in the other box. So now I can combine those two. It's dumb that it just wouldn't do that automatically for me. Make all of my inventory one big continuous inventory, right? Like, that would be awesome, but no, it doesn't do that. All right, is there any room in this one or anything I can combine in this one? Uh, no, that's not even the right one. This one. I, I can't even access this one. There we go. Uh, I guess I'll just unload the PAL fluids, right? There you go. And what is this? Venom glands. There you go. I'll unload the bones. There we go. All right, now my inventory is much better. Okay. Have I thought about involving Jasper more in my content? What what content exactly do I put out that I can involve Jasper more in? Like the problem the reason Jasper's not in here all the time is twofold. Number one, he's the kind of cat that always wants attention. The more he's in here, the more he's gonna want me to pay attention to him rather than hang out with you guys. And you've seen sometimes he he causes problems. He'll try to bite the wires or whatever. When he's in here, I can't I I can play with him for a few minutes, but I gotta I gotta do a stream, right? And the other thing is, he's the kind of cat that doesn't just like to sit around in one spot. So you're like, oh, why don't you do Jasper streams with Jasper Cam? Because he won't sit in one spot for the cam to pick him up. He's moving constantly. That's the kind of cat he is. So yeah. it wouldn't really work that way. It wouldn't work out well that way. Um, could you please come back here, Malpaca? Why are you running from me? You're my pal. <laughs> my own pal runs from me. All right, so I guess we can either we can catch some more low-level guys to try to hit 17. Um, oh, you know what? We don't have the, one of these monkeys. Oh, God. He's huge. Yeah, we're not going to aggro him. Mammo Crest? We will not aggro him, but we will we will try to catch the TNZ. No, no, no. There we go. We got it. Got a TNZ. That's a new one. Is the level 11 still down there now? Or did it despawn? I, it might have despawned. Because um, I wanted to try to get it, but... Yeah, I don't see it anymore. Hmm. Well... There was an item down here I wanted. Oh, look. Oh, these are level 11s? Ooh. Should try to catch more alpacas. I can't... Oh, camera. Caught it. Nice. Very, very good. Those see, the harder they are to catch, I think you get more experience. It seems that way. Oh, I'm hungry now. I'm hungry? Didn't I just eat? I thought I just ate one of these. I don't know. I got real hungry all of a sudden. Alright. This has a Skyrim element? I mean, no. 
I wouldn't say this has a Skyrim element unless all open world games are Skyrim. I don't think it has anything to do with Skyrim. Come on. Yes. Come on. Yeah! I'm almost 17 and that's what I need. How did that ball miss? <laughs> it bounced right off of him. We got him. Alright. We hit 17. That's what I need to get the blueprint for the pot. I'll just get it now so I don't forget. So we are looking for three flame organs. We have one back at base. We need to find more fire type pals and take them out and this will drop those organs. There you go. What's that up there? I don't know. Let's find out what this is up here. Something unique and different. What the heck is this? A mine? The abandoned mine shaft. Now, unlike those dungeons that we've come into, is this uh, an instance that never goes away and is always there? It kind of seems that way, doesn't it? Like, this one's not going to go away. It'll always be here for us to enter. Because I'm wondering what I should do. Uh, should I enter it? Oh, well, this is different. This is not what I expected. It's not an instance at all. I have unused stat points. Oh. I'm going to go more health this time. Let's level the health. Who the heck is this? Whoa, a black marketeer. Is this an enemy? It's level 40. I definitely shouldn't fight it, but can I talk to him? Does anyone know how this works? Because I cannot fight a level 40 enemy. But if you can talk to him about possibly buying stuff, I will do that. Does anyone know? Hello, Iron Man the Power. He's not an enemy. You can speak with him. Hold on. What the hell kind of face is that? Look at his face. Is that his real face or is he wearing a mask? Like, look at this. Look at this face. Everyone get ready. It's going to get closer. Ready to ready this? Look at this face. Take a look. Look at the face. You guys like the face? Look at this face. You guys want to get a closer look? Look at this face. Look at it. <laughs> Oh my god. Would you trust a guy who looks like that to sell you stuff? Do you like that face? Alright, I guess we'll talk to him. I trade him in, in, in any kind of pal. Whether it's stolen pals or even prohibited types, take a look. Buy contraband. Whoa. I only have like... 2,700. These all cost around 5,000. Look at this one. Maraith loop moon. I have a doom mood. Wow, the doom mood's the most expensive, and I have a couple of those. I have a floppy. I don't have a valet. Sell. Oh, I could sell pals. How much does he give me? How do I tell how much he'll give me for a pal? I don't see a value. Select what to sell. Let's say I wanted to sell one of these land balls, right? One hundred twelve. Because I, I certainly don't need, like, 14 lamb balls, right? This one's clumsy. A dragon killer lamb ball? Yeah, I believe that when I see it. <laughs> a sadist chickpea? It's a sadist. What? Destructive. Apparently, this chickpea is not good. It's considered destructive. See that? I should sell some of these crazy duplicates. A pyromaniac lamb ball? Yeah, I'll get rid of that one. 
coward, pacifist, and destructive. It's like a triple, a triple crappy cat. We'll get rid of that. Let's get rid of some of these low-level daydreams, right? Ah, uh, my eyes are burning. Uh, ooh, I have a this level eight milpaca we can get rid of. So how much will I make? A thousand. All right, let's sell that. So now I have three thousand nine hundred. Darn! I wanted to get this one. I wanted to get the valet. So I need another thousand. His inventory respawns if you leave and come back. It's a totally different inventory. Oh really? So you can just keep checking to see what you can buy. That's not bad. That's interesting. Uh, oh, here we go. We certainly don't need four of these. Get rid of this Kilimari. Fragment foliage. Uh... You hear that? You get fat XP bonuses when you get 10 of each. I'm aware of that. Is this enough? No, I still need to sell like two or three more. Oh, I'm short by 100. Oh, man. Uh... The land balls you can just easily get again. Wait, I'm still... He's not giving me enough. This is ridiculous. He's saying he's going to pay me that amount, and then he really doesn't. He's not paying me what he says he's going to pay me. He's kind of ripping me off here. Another land ball? These daydreams are good. They're all swift. And obviously I don't want to sell one that's the last one of a type. <sighs> Still trying. Why do my eyes burn sometimes? I don't know. I have the fan on. It could just be that the wind is blowing in my eye and it irritates it. Uh, I have no clue. It could be my eye. I don't know. I have bad eyes. I don't know. <laughs> I don't really think about it too much. I just say, ah, my eye hurts, and then I stop caring, and I move on. Okay. Now I'm going to buy this valet. Or should I wait and leave and cut? Now I'm going to buy the valet. Okay, I bought a valet. It's a new pal captured. All right, that's a neat way to get ones that you don't have if you haven't found them yet. Now I know that that's there. I can come back whenever I want. The only bummer is there's no spot on the map. Can I put, like, a... A marker. So I'm gonna put what should I what marker should I use here? How do I change? Oh here we go. Uh none of these look like a vendor, right? Like none of these actually look like a vendor icon. Huh. What do you think? I'll do this. There you go. Okay, so now I'll know this is the, the black market dude. Oh, I should have done the horn. I think I want to do the horn icon if I find, like, a big enemy or boss that I want to come back and fight at some point. Then I'll use the horn icon for that. Okay, well, that was cool. We got a new one now. A new pal, that is. And we leveled up to the point where I can make the cooking pot. But remember, I'm looking for flame organs, and I'm looking for wheat. And I haven't found either since I've been out. I want to hit level 18, and then I want to try to fight the boss, because the boss is level 18. No, I don't want to pick that up. What did I get? Picked up some crap. I don't even know what it was. I actually have no clue what it was I picked up. Wood, here, I'll drop the wood. Discard the wood. Where am I? If we're heading south, here's a unique one. Ooh, 23 King Paka. 
So it's an uh, like a super boss alpaca. Hmm. It could be eye strain. It could be dry eyes. I, I would believe both of those things. I did used to have issues with dry eyes when I was younger, so I used to always have eye drops that sometimes I would use in the morning. Um, whoa, what is that guy? A bush roar. No, bush roar. Why can't I spit? What happened? That should be a good one. He has like zero health. Bush, bush roar, bush boar, bush boar. Jade is saying, next time I play Tekken, can I either try Zaoyu or Law or Yoshimitsu or Kazuya? I'm not sure. What I'm waiting for is feedback, and I haven't checked yet today to see if anyone left me feedback on the podcast. I need to know, do people want me moving forward in Tekken 8 to keep, treat it more casually and constantly try new characters and mess around in that regard? Or would you prefer if I try to play it more seriously and only focus in on, say, three or four characters and focus on getting better with them? Because... I'm not playing Tekken nearly as much as I played Street Fighter 6. There's just not as much interest for some odd reason. I, I don't get it. Why? Because I think Tekken is great. But apparently, the viewing audience isn't agreeing because they're not watching it as much. Uh, so my question is... Shit. Oh, nice. It bounced. So my question is... Do I take it, try to get better at it and take it more seriously? But then, you know, play with a smaller group of characters? Or... Do I will play like play with everyone casually, but never really get good? That's really the, the question for everyone. And it was a split audience this morning on the podcast. People didn't really have an answer. Some wanted one way, and some wanted the other. So I'm definitely looking for feedback in that regard. Gang Leonic says I would prefer more characters, and I like. I like uh, Tekken over Street Fighter. I don't have a copper key on me. In fact, I don't think I have any copper keys, right? Didn't I use them all, the ones that I had? A guard is the vendor. A wandering merchant. What does the wandering merchant have? Let's find out. I got good items in stock. What do you have? Milk for cooking. Red berries. Oh, it has wheat for a hundred. Oh man, can I sell something? Yeah, let me sell something. So I'll have the wheat. I need that wheat for the uh, for the thing. How do I sell max? How do I sell? How do I sell all? I want to sell. How do I do this? How the fuck do I sell? I said sell. How do? Oh, why? There we go. He'll give me a hundred thirty for the wool. Go ahead. Good. Now I'm buying the wheat. Perfect. I can now craft the wheat plantation. Now I need a flame organ. He doesn't have flame organs. Damn. He's got all kinds of medicine I've never seen before. Look at this. Hmm. Okay. All right. That's cool. We got the wheat that we needed by buying it from him. So that was a good find, right? Could you stop running from me? <laughs> oh. Oh, I can't get it. It's high up. And it's across a freaking river. So I can't get to that. Darn. And now I'm hungry again. How are you so hungry all the time? What kind of a glutton are you that you have to constantly be feeding your, your stomach with this stuff? Hmm. Huh. Haseo says, looks like exploring paid off. Indeed. We have, not only did we find a, a, a bunch of new stuff. Is that another fast travel? Oh, man. Oh, we found the town. People were saying the town was over here. Nice. Okay, we got to get down there and not die. I want to go to the town. We found... Oh, no. Ah. We found it. I'm stuck. Ah! Ah! Let me out! Let me out of this river! There we go. We found the town, and we got a fast travel point in here. Oh, this is excellent. 
Gossiping villager. Reliable officer. Innkeeper. First human settlement in the game. It's fast travel, it, baby. Yeah. Now, if only we could find flame type pals to beat up, right? Then we could we could actually do the cooking pot, and then we could actually level up. I haven't seen any yet. Wait, what's that? Hold on. There's something hidden back here. I saw it. Oh no. Oh no! Oh! There's something hidden back here. I saw green. I saw a hint of green. When I was looking this direction. Am I seeing things? I swear I saw... Ah ha ha! Look at that! Look at that! They hit it. Now how do I get to it? Maybe I gotta get off my, uh, my guy. How do I get... There we go. Got it. I knew I saw green. Cool. Alright, now let's get out of here. No, I... Oh! I fell into the crevasse. No. No. Oh, no. Not the crevasse. This is bad. I can't get out. This is very bad. Oh, no. I guess we gotta swim out and see where this goes. This is not good. <laughs> this is not good. Where is this gonna take us, man? Oh, God. Where does this go? I still can't get out. Look, I'm still stuck in here. Oh, boy. Do you think they're, they're, the towns have PAL centers? I didn't see one. This looked like a, a, a small village as opposed to like a big city, but I don't know. I don't know how this game works, honestly. Oh, anyone see anything? Oh, no. What's this? Where the heck are we? Looks like we're coming out in the ocean. This is not good. How am I going to get out of here? I'm so stuck down here. For the record, the platforming is not good in this game. Look, I cannot get up here. Are those bones out there? It looks like bones of a giant creature or something. So now I'm way out here. Ugh. <laughs> uh, well, there's like a big bridge or aqueduct or something up there. I don't know how I'm supposed to get up here, so I'm just going to try to climb. This is a big mess I got myself into by falling down here. This is not cool. I don't know how I'm going to get up here because I don't have enough stamina. I run out of stamina climbing really fast. So I don't think I can make it up here. I'll try, but I'm not very confident about this. Well, I actually made it. Okay. So hard to see. I made it across. Cool. Jade, as I was saying, I don't know what I'm going to do next time I play Tekken 8. I don't know if it's going to be a new character or me playing with more with King. I feel like maybe I should focus more on the characters that I've used to get better at the game. Because if I keep swapping characters, I'm never going to improve. I'm just going to only know base level stuff with each character and, and 
basically as soon as I get to that certain level of competition, I'm going to get my butt whooped. So I'm kind of on the fence as to what to do, and I'm waiting for feedback from everyone on that before I make a decision, Jin. Why is he aggroing to me? What the? Well, this guy aggroed to me. I didn't want to fight him. Well, we made it back to the town, so that's good. Anything here? Probably just a, another uh, vendor, I would think. But well, I was right. There it is. There's the vendor right there, the Wandering Merchant. But I don't need to buy anything from the Wandering Merchant right now. I'm happy I found the town and we can come back here when we're ready. Should I should I, should I mark this? And, oh, it says on it, small settlement. Never mind. As long as it says what it is, I'm happy. So that way I know when I come back what, what it is. But there's something across the way here it shows. Oh, now what happened? Oh, no, again with this. Oh. Serious? Wow, the platforming really stinks. When you're on... Oh, look at this. I can't even jump over this fence. I'm clearly clearing it. But they, it's terrible. Oh, that's really bad. Well, if I hit 18, I think we're going to have a second go at the first boss. So let's see what we've got up here. More rush roars. I do find it ridiculous that sometimes you'll get these down to almost no health at all. And then they still escape. Like, but I beat the crap out of it. How is it escaping? It's not even like it's a, a rare pal. I've seen it a million times. Oh, is that a chest? Yes, it is. It's a purple chest. A pal sphere and some gold coins. So I guess purple's low level. And the, uh... And, and uh, gold is mid-level, and red's the best, but red, you need the, uh... Red, you would need the, uh... The key, the copper key to open. Okay. 672 says, The problem with Street Fighter is, after a while, you only use the same three to four characters, and it got stale. Well, I could have used other characters, but you understand, I would have been starting over and trying to learn from scratch, and it would have been low-level gameplay again. And people seemed to complain when I did that. They were like, oh, I want, I want high-level ranked. I want high-level ranked. Well, that's not how fighting games work, right? It's just not. Like, you need to slowly learn a character. And the characters that I knew better were the ones that I could play at higher level. That's what people seem to want. Again, it's like you can't please everyone all the time. I'm well aware some people wanted more variety. They kept asking, what's the next character? What's the next character? But, ooh, look at that one. Probably not going to get that one. I went the wrong direction, by the way. Yeah, I totally did. Did we find... This is another another boss tower? No, this is the one we've already been at. Okay. Oh, a frozen egg. Oh, that's cool. It'll be a new... A new type. When we, uh, when we raise it, right? So anyway, yeah... Right now, I'm kind of at that same level. I'm at that impasse where I don't know... What the hell? These two are fighting? Two... They're fighting each other. Oh, man. They can do giant combos and stuff. Look at this. This is like a high-level Street Fighter fight right here. Look. Why would these two Mamorests have gotten into a fight with each other? Now it's like they're running away or something. I don't know what they're doing. <laughs> Two females, right? Two females are fighting. 
That's what it looks like. They're beating the shit out of each other. I better try to catch the pal that gets weakened. I don't think it'll work. I think I, I don't think I'll be able to catch it. I could always try, but I really don't think it's gonna work. Damn, a goo moss was just walking by and got insta killed. Whoa! Killed it! Now it's friendly. Damn, you kicked the corpse around. Look. <laughs> Kicked the ragdoll corpse around. It didn't drop any items, sadly. I was hoping it would drop some loot, but it didn't drop anything. I mean, it has almost no health. There's no chance I could catch this thing. Watch. Zero! Point one percent. I'm going to go with no. That's not worth it. <laughs> All right. We found what appears to be a, a dungeon cave, right? It is. Hillside Cavern with a boss that's level 13. Eh. I still need flame organs, which we haven't found. We might have to go back to the starter area to look for the fire types. Missed. Missed again? Yeah, I did. I missed twice. Oh, come on. Why are you so evasive? Wow. He does not want to be caught. I'm wasting so many balls. Dude, I'm about to give up. Forget this. He's being too much of a pain in my ass. Forget it. Ugh. There's another cave instance that right there that you could do. Gonna split the part in a minute. We're almost 18. Like I said, once we're 18, I am going to make a run for that boss. I think that we can beat him this time. I'm feeling confident with all the improvements we've done with the, with the bow and arrow here. It's now a crossbow with the better spear, with the, with the armor we've got on, with the shield we've got on, being able to ride these guys and the improvements I've done to my damage output and my health. I think we're going to be able to beat the boss. Oh, level 23, King Paka. I don't think we can kill a level 23. So I will not aggro this guy. He's a big boy. Cool looking. But out of my, out of my depth, right? Too high level for me. Am I level 16, Malpaka? Melpaka. Why can't just go walk? Shoosh. Oi. Oh my god. Stuck. Whoa! We're back! We're back in town. It's just a different angle at the town. I keep ending up going in circles. I want to go this way. Yeah, this is the direction I want to go.
Yeah, sadly, I can't, uh... I can't play... Mark says you're a variety content creator, so you just can't play enough of a fighting game. Street Fighter Six players are playing something like five hours a day minimum. Oh, yeah, I know. Anyone who's a pro player, they totally are playing that much a day. 100%. That's a given. To them, that's, that's their life, man. Hungry again. Hungry like the wolf. This is the right way. This is where I wanted to go because this is a new area this way. I just keep getting turned around. Probably a new environment this way. Well, if I don't, uh... If I don't find any flame organ stuff very soon, I'm just going to basically go back to base. And, uh... And start over, you know, in those early areas, there's a lot of flame, ty st st flame type pals. Because then when I get the flame organ, then I can make this cooking pot. Man, I just can't go the ways I want to go. Everything's like a dead end. See that? You know what? Screw this. Beautiful blue water. Yeah, I, I got to make the cooking pot and I got to make the wheat plantation. And once those are built, that's all I need to hit the next level. I'm, I, I also want to hit 18 so I can go fight that boss. That's my two goals for tonight. Don't know why I dismounted. Pretty fun to be able to mount, mount and ride these pals. This is much better than going on foot. Oh, man. Blue Mountain Dew. The water looks like Blue Mountain Dew. Wow. That's the comparison you made, huh? Yeah. Bonk. We're getting there. What is that noise? This is a new area. I want to see if we can find a fast travel here. Same enemies, though. Uh, two of these dire hounds. Excuse me. Yeah, nothing new here. Same guys. What? Wow! Guys are being a pain. There's that big bridge that we saw. So now we can cross that? We could. I think that just goes across to over there. See, I'm looking for a fast travel point over here. Vietnamese comrade, that's all good. I hope you enjoy your Lunar, lunar New Year celebrations coming up. And I, I look forward to seeing you back when you can make it. Oh, look at this. Take that, assholes. More. Wow, it's all these syndicate thugs fighting the pals up here for some reason. There's a ton of them. Let's whoop that ass. Indeed we did. We teamed up with the pals and we whooped some ass. Incineram? Why is the Incineram attacking me along with the... In what is going on here?
see if I can catch the Incineran. Did I get it? Holy crap, I got the Incineram. Nice. That's a brand new combat type. It looks pretty damn cool, too. So I don't know what happened there. There was like a big fight breaking out. And for some reason, those pals actually were like teaming up with, with the Syndicate thugs. I've never seen that happen before. So I don't know why that happened, but won the fight. What is this tree? This is new. What just happened? I'm sorry, Tansy. I didn't mean to do that. I'm sorry. Oh, no! Oh! <laughs> Did she hit level 18 now? What? Oh. Kidding me. Okay. Level 18. What is this tree? Ice skill fruit, iceberg. What the fuck? It doesn't work. I can't, why can't I pick this up? Look, I got that one. Oh, was it close enough? It's a skill fruit tree. So you have to jump and grab the skill fruits. Okay. All right, cool. <clears throat> Let's do health again. Okay. So we hit level 18. The one bummer is I haven't found a fast travel point around here. If I could, I'd feel safe going back to base and then leveling up and taking on the boss. But I want to be able to fast travel back to this area and there just doesn't seem to be a point anywhere, right? They won't let me climb this? Why? This is so ridiculous. I seriously can't climb this? My pal is hungry. God, why can't I go this way? Look. You're kidding. Why can't I jump there? Oh my god. It's so bad. I figure if I go high up, then maybe I can see the fast travel point from here. If I look down from here. Look what I found. A unique egg. A dark egg. So down there, there's appears to be a camp. We haven't been there yet. We haven't been there yet either. There's two different camps in this area that we haven't been to. That's a fast travel point I've already been to over there. There's a fast travel point. I don't see any near me, which is weird that there's none here. I guess we should head down towards that camp. That looks like the best direction to go from here. Because that camp down there doesn't look too special. But maybe you think... Oh, I see a fast travel point. It's right there. It's straight ahead down there. Okay. So we got to descend this mountain, not die, and get down to that point. See that? There we go. Thank God I got that. I just found another egg. A scorching egg. Cool. Alright, so we'll do a fast travel point over here. Look at this beautiful meadow with all these uh, flowers in it. What was that noise? Oh, what the fuck is that? 
Oh, God. Oh, God. There's, like, an attack going on. I don't want to fight these guys. Now, let's run. Let's run and get to this fast travel. We'll go back to base. We'll level up. We'll do all this stuff. All right. Good, good, good. All right. Cool. That's our latest point. Let's just go back to base. Good point to split the part here. Uh, and then continue on. Good stuff. Yeah, that was good. That was a good run. All right. Let's uh, split the part. When I come back, we're going to do a lot. We're going to incubate some eggs. We're going to build the wheat plantation. And we're going to continue on from there. Very nice.